In this video, we are going to show you how to transfer files via OTG so that you can transfer data from Android to flash drive and vice versa easily and quickly. When we are talking about AN on the Go Cable OTG, we are referring to a device that allows communication between mobile phone devices and flash drives and SD card readers. To transfer files via OTG requires a lot of caution and attention. Some people have ended up losing files or duplicating them by just making simple mistakes. Before starting the transfer process, be sure of the specific location of the files, connect the flash drive on Android and then follow the following procedure to transfer files between Android phone and flash drive. Step 1. Confirm the phone's connectivity. Ensure that the OTG cable or a flash drive can be connected to your phone. It can be done by using an OTG cable to connect a flash drive to the phone. Alternatively, you can connect your micro USB flash drive to your phone directly. The connectivity capacity can also be determined by using apps such as USB OTG Checker. Newer versions of Android phones can easily detect a connected device, and users only need male and female adapters and the flash drive. The difference between the male and the female ends is that the male end is the protruding side, while the female end is the hollow one. Step 2. Connect the flash drive to the phone through the OTG. In this step, you need to learn how to use the OTG cable and USB flash drive and also how to use micro USB or the Type-C flash drive. All you need to do is to attach the female end of the OTG cable to the flash drive. Attach the phone to the male end of the wire after you insert the flash drive into the adapter. In the other method, you just insert your micro USB flash drive directly to your phone's USB port. Step 3. Allow access. You will know whether the connection has been successful if there will be a notification requesting you to allow access. While some devices display this notification directly, others require the user to get it manually. After you have approved the access, click on the folder containing the files to select and open it. Step 4. Transfer the files. Since the folder is already open, identify the specific data that you need, tap and long press them for a successful selection. Copy or import them and then click on the new location that you want to move them. The process will start immediately, and you can see the progress rate on a different notification bar. Step 5. Disconnect the cable. You can only unplug the cable after all the files have been successfully transferred. If you want to confirm whether all the files have been moved, you can open the new folder and check the new files. It is advisable to give your phone the command to end the connection before unplugging the cable.